Good morning ladies and gentlemen and welcome to another fantastic day on planet Earth. Today I'm going to go and try to get to Stafford Castle but I don't know if you can actually get in without paying um, before it's open. It doesn't open until about 11 o'clock and it's a bit earlier than 11 o'clock. You'll also notice that I've moved the GoPro uh, so as number one I can pedal and number two you can see more. It's not a name of a person. Well, it might be. It doesn't matter. Bollocks, not important. So it should be closer to the road. I hope, anyway. I mean, that Land Rover there. He's just deliberately pulled right up against the curb, look. Purely to stop me from getting... Oh, Totty. Hairy legs. Purely to stop me from undertaking. Ah, oh, I haven't been up here for... a long, 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 long few years. Now, apparently, it's up this road. Probably going the wrong way as usual. If I can't get into the castle, it doesn't really matter. I'm, I'm not really fussed. I've never been there at all. And apparently it's a nice place. I like nice places. I don't know where it is. Apparently it's up here on the right. Right, so we're going to turn into Stafford Castle and I hope that we can actually get in. The gate's open. And it's a 10 mile an hour speed limit, so I'll do 11, because I'm a rebel. <laughs> oh, shit, little shit. Are you going here? Yes. Uh, the other thing, and me being the dickhead, I've got loads of pairs of gloves. And I always bring a pair of gloves there, and I've got all my stuff ready this morning, got everything packed. And brought out two left gloves. I completely forgot that I've got more than one pair of my short gloves, my fingerless gloves, so I picked two left ones up. What a dick. Oh, there's the castle. The castle is up on the right hand side, which you can't bloody see, but that's what we're going to go and see. It was a castle built in 15, 14, 13, 12, 12, 11, 11 a.m. one morning. Um, I haven't got a clue who built it. I think it was Robert De Niro or something like that. There's a lot of flies around here. And again, they always hang around shit, don't they? Okay, I've been going quite a while now. Am I just going around in one big bloody circle? Or does this actually take you up to the castle? I love this exercise. It really makes me fit. It's fantastic. How do you get to the castle? Where is it? Have they moved it? The woodland trail. I'm going to go on a woodland trail. It's not off-road. Uh, oh, shit. I think that's a bad idea. No, that's a bad idea. That's a really bad idea. Oh, God. I'm going to get... How the hell am I going to get down now? Uh, I'm going to have to get off it. That was a really stupid idea, Tony. What do you do that for, you dickhead? Oh, shit. Oh, that was close. Yeah, that was close. <laughs> oh, yeah, another thing as well. I can pedal. Although it makes a right racket. Oh, shit. Watch what you're doing, Tony. Oh, this is nice. Oh, yeah. This is very nice. So, do you go up the hill? Is that... Oh, yeah. Oh, this is steep. Wow, that was about two kilowatts going up there. Oh, look. Oh my god. Oh, this is stunning. <sighs> Look at that for a view. Anyway, 
this is the castle and somewhere you can see that well you can see this for absolutely miles around when it's all lit up at night look at that this is the only real castle that I can get to um, without going in the car and travelling somewhere a proper castle not just some of the used to build at school or you know in the garden or something like that and some windows and everything wow proper castle on top of a hill <sighs> stay boy Ah, oh. a uh, photo opportunity. I can't see this. I can't see my phone because my glasses are. Where I'm going to put my glasses? That I'm not going to get them broken. Precariously put them there. I shall post a few photos. If I put these over the, over the camera like that, you're probably not going to be able to see this, but you can see it perfectly there like that. If I turn it that way, you can't bloody see it. See what I mean? So I, I was going to take a photograph. It was a couple of couple of months ago. I was going to go and take a photograph. And I thought my bloody phone had broken. <laughs> what the hell's going on? I just couldn't understand it because I'm old. Well, just so you know, it's a bit of useless information, but my GoPro is recording at 50 frames a second, which is fine. And I noticed the other day, uh, when I was editing a video, that the Firefly Q6 is 60 frames a second, and there's no way of changing it. I don't think I can change the GoPro to 50 frames a second, 60, or the other one to 50. So unfortunately, there's not a lot I can do. Oh, are you serious? I've been, <laughs> I've been all around. I've been all around the outside just to get. I didn't realise the entrance. You could just go up here. This is where I came in. What a dick. Well, there you go. That was Stafford Castle. It's the only castle, like I say, it's the only castle that I can actually get to on my bike. Um, if I wanted to go to any others, which I could do, I'd have to put the bike in the car, which I can't lift it up because it's too bloody heavy. I'd have to get somebody to help me lift the bike into the car and then probably help me lift the bike out the other end. It's just too much hassle. I can't be bothered. I know! I think we should go into Stafford. I can show you some oldie worldy uh, houses, really old houses, like in the 1980s. I need to talk about the uh, the MSVA. Now it's still sort of in the pipeline. I'm, I'm sort of distracted, I suppose, with version four because I've been thinking about how to do it. Now version 4 is going to be based on a motorbike frame, it's actually going to be based on a road legal, something that is already registered on the road. So simply what I'll do is take the engine out, so I'm looking for something with a knackered engine and clutch. You know, running gear doesn't really matter at all. And then I can just put electrics in. So that's ideally what I'm looking for. So for the, the MSVA for this one has sort of taken a back seat unfortunately. I can't concentrate on two things at once because I'm a bloke. Blokes are shit at multitasking. Although it does come with age, you can actually multitask because you'll find that you can piss yourself and sneeze at the same time. Now that, that place there, that's where uh, I went to college there when I were a lad, when I was 17, 17 I think. Did my agricultural mechanics there. I'm a qualified agricultural mechanic, wouldn't you believe it? And there's a windmill here, I'll show you the windmill. 
We'll have a look at the windmill. There's a windmill without the sails on it. I don't know how old that place is. It's very, very, very old. Stafford Church. The trouble with having an electric bike, you hear every single noise, every little rattle, every bang, every squeak. Like I've got one on the back. Oh, here's the river. Oh, it's not a river, it's more like a brook. Actually, it is a river. Which was always, I was always full of um, shopping trolleys and God knows what. It probably still is. I probably have to dredge it once a month. This used to be the town mill, as it says there actually. Built in early, um, Staffordshire since at least 1164. <sighs> that building there, I mean that's the library that's been bloody hell, I don't know how long that... Well, longer than I've been on this earth. <laughs> <laughs> this is fun. See, when I were a lad, and this car park was here, it was free. And on a weekend, on a Saturday night or something like that, you know, you've had a few. <laughs> and we used to come around here. And all we used to do is go to the top <laughs> and just sit on the top and look out. Why am I ducking? I keep ducking. Oh, they put all barriers up here now. I hate heights. I absolutely detest heights. I can't, I can't, I've got this bloody post in my way. Top of the world. I haven't been up here for bloody decades. I, I think the last time I came up here I was probably 20, 21. That's so 30, over 30 years ago. I wonder what that noise is. It's a bit worrying. Yeah, it's the chain tension of catching on the on the um, on the plaque. Never used to be any barriers around here when I were a lad. It was what's called common sense. Don't bloody jump off because it's going to hurt when you hit the ground. Actually, it wouldn't hurt. You won't feel a bloody thing. <laughs> you juvenile Tony. <laughs> Just at the wrong time. No pressure. <laughs> Thank you.
Is this the way out? Yes, look at that. <laughs> oh, that was fun. Right, what are you going to do now? Well, it didn't work out very well for you, did it? I need to adjust that bloody tensioner. That's better. Noise is gone. So I don't know, to be honest, I'm going to tell you the truth, I really don't know if I'm going to do the MSVA with this. Uh, it, it'll take the fun factor out of it and I won't be able to do 15 miles an hour anymore and I'll, I'll, I, won't, <coughs> I won't be able to have fun, I won't be able to go off road because it'll have a number plate on it. I won't be able to go up the chase, you know, it's not... <sighs> It'll take all the, the, the excitement and all the fun out of it. Version 4 is going to be built on a, on a currently existing road legal bike uh, with completely knackered engine gearbox or whatever. So I can just rip the lot out because I don't need it. And then that can be... look this way. And then that can be the base of, of an MSVA test. Because if I take the engine out and I put and convert it into electric, it's still got to go through the MSVA. Although for testing purposes and stuff, you know, I can I can still ride it on the road. I'm not 100% I'm not decided, but it's been going through my mind for quite a while now of, of what exactly to do, and, uh, you know, it's, it, oh, I, I just, I, I feel like I've let a lot of people down, but I feel relieved, I suppose, for coming to my senses and f figuring out that it's not going to be really worth it, and it'll ruin it. I know it's going to piss a lot of people off, and I do apologise, you know, but version 4 will be purposely built to do a job the same as this was, and the, and the purpose of this was... Bloody hell. The, same, the purpose of this was to have a, a shitload of fun with it, and that's exactly what I've achieved. Anyway, ladies and gentlemen, um, now I've left you on a bit of a downer, I'm going to head back home now. I've just got to pop into B&Q. <laughs> <laughs> on my bike. Um, I'm going to head back home and I'll catch you next time. And remember, life is definitely worth living on this measly earth. All you've got to do is find out what makes you the happiest you possibly can be. Get out there, do it every day and bollocks to what anybody else thinks. Where the hell am I going to park now? I haven't got a lock. I could just nick a flower. I'll sort it on going home.